be asking yourself what is going on here and you may be also asking yourself have I just coloured my hair? Well, find out at the end what's going on and yes, I have coloured my hair. <laughs> what do you think? A warm welcome to the channel. My name is James. This is the James Neil Cooper Show and today we do have the latest pictures of the Free Gorda Dam itself. One tourist was there and managed to put his feed onto Twitter and it looks like this. And what you can see here is a person who went on a Yangtze River cruise and he's at one of the gorges and you can see the actual water levels, how low they are. Now, I don't know how many meters that is, but I could imagine maybe 10, possibly 15, at a pinch, maybe 20, don't know. What do you think? Leave us a comment in the form below. Let's have a look at the levels and also let's have a look at the weather in central China over the next coming days. What can you actually see if you go on a Yangtze cruise? Well, you'll see lots of gorges and uh, here is an aerial full view for about 60 seconds of the area of the Free Gorges Reservoir. So here I am in Pattaya and last night I went out with a really good friend, a guy that I at first worked with when I worked for the royal family in Brunei and uh, we did get, well, a little bit drunk and if you want to see more of that, well, it's at the end. Now, what else is happening in China because I don't have any more information about the Three Gorges. Here is from the great translation movements in China and permanent quarantine sites construction projects happening in China. Wonderful. And when people do get pot tested positive, even in the countryside, they seem to scarper because they don't want to go on lockdown and go into a quarantine site. Yes, even in the countryside in China. And one more thing. How difficult was your driving test for me? I was 17, I did when I first one, I failed, and then I was very close to 18 on the second one, and I passed. But this is the Chinese practical driving test. It looks actually really...
And that brings us to a close, but the video will continue. In other words, that's all I have for speaking for today. I'm going to go out and get some more British food. I come to Thailand for British food. That's really weird, isn't it? But there's a big expat community here and live to serve. So that's what I'm going to do in a moment or two. But I'm going to leave you with, I know what you did last night. Bye-bye for now. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Cheerio. Enjoy.